Hello everyone and welcome to today's tutorial. In this video, we will explore how to enhance your home system security using AIDE, the Advanced Intrusion Detection Environment on OpenSUSE Linux. AIDE is a powerful tool that helps monitor your system for unauthorized changes, ensuring your data remains safe and secure. Whether you are a home user or an advanced Linux enthusiast, this guide will walk you through a complete setup with real life examples. Before we dive into the setup, let's briefly discuss what AIDE is. AIDE Advanced Intrusion Detection Environment is a host based intrusion detection system, HIDS. It works by creating a baseline database of file attributes by regularly comparing the system's current state to this database. AIDE can detect unauthorized changes. If a file has been modified, deleted, or added unexpectedly, AIDE will alert you. So why is AIDE important for home users? Protects personal files from unauthorized modifications, detects malware or unwanted system changes, helps maintain system integrity after software updates. Let's start by installing AIDE. Open your terminal and run this command sudo zipper install AIDE. After the installation, verify the installation, ensure AIDE is installed correctly, run this command AIDE space dash V. This should return the installed version of AIDE. Now that AIDE is installed, we need to configure it to monitor critical system files. The main configuration file is located at slash etc slash AIDE.conf. The default slash etc slash AIDE.conf file on OpenSUSE Leap includes predefined rules and monitoring directives. Let's break it down. First configuration parameters like database location. Database and database underscore out parameters specify where AIDE stores and updates its baseline database. Then we have output settings. Verpus equal one report underscore URL equal std out warn that sim links equal yes. These settings control verbosity and reporting behavior. Custom rules predefined monitoring rules. These rules define what attributes AIDE monitors, such as permissions, inode changes, ownership, size, and cryptographic checksums. And then we have monitored directories and files. We have critical files like slash etc, slash bin, slash spin, and log like slash var slash log. And we notice here anything started with exclamation mark excluded directory. These exclusions prevent AIDE from monitoring frequently changing directories. Before proceeding, we need to ensure that there are no syntax errors in our AIDE configuration file. So open your terminal and run this command AIDE space dash dash config dash check. If the output is empty, the configuration is valid. If there is any output, it indicates an error that must be fixed before proceeding. With our configuration finalized, let's initialize AIDE to create a baseline of the system. Run the initialization command AIDE space dash dash init and this command will take few minutes to finish. Rename the generated new database to set it as the baseline by running this command move and the new database and we rename it to AIDE.DB. This step is essential as it avoids compromising your database. It is recommended to use a medium which can be written once to prevent the database being modified. Never leave the database on the computer which you want to monitor. This database will be used to detect future system changes. Now that AIDE has a baseline, let's check for any unauthorized modifications. Run a system integrity check by running the command AIDE space dash dash check. Analyze the output. 
If no changes are detected, you will see a message stating that everything matches. If changes are detected, review the affected files carefully. To ensure ongoing security monitoring, we can automate AIDE to run checks at regular intervals. I use sudo to switch to root and now we will use the command cron tab space dash e. After you hit enter, there is a file will be opened. Add the following line to schedule a daily check at 2 a.m. Let's read the line. It is started with the zero space two space asterisk space asterisk space asterisk and then the path of the command line aide space the argument dash dash check this will automatically run aide every day at 2 a.m once you finish editing don't forget to save and exit the file you can check your cron tab is saved correctly by running the command cron tab space dash l it will list all the cron tabs you have as a root user Whenever legitimate changes occur, such as system updates, we need to update AIDS database. Run the update command AIDE space dash dash update. Replace the old database with the new one by renaming the new file generated. This ensures AIDE remains up to date with expected system changes. Congratulations, you have successfully installed, configured, and automated AIDE on OpenSUSE Leap to monitor your system for unauthorized changes. AIDE helps detect unauthorized file modifications. Regular checks improve system security. Automating AIDE ensures continuous monitoring. Updating the database after legitimate changes prevents false alerts. If you found this tutorial helpful, please like, share, and subscribe for more Linux security and system administration tips. Stay safe and see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.